Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. So before we get into the video, I wanted to talk to you guys about a way you could earn extra cash and gift cards with Global Test Market. So pretty much by taking research surveys, you can earn extra cash. And the surveys are about things you like and by doing that, they're helping brands improve their products. I've actually tried Global Test Market myself and it actually is a really great way to earn extra cash and gift cards. So make sure you guys click the link in my description box below and start earning your cash and those gift cards. So I want to say thank you so, so much to Global Test Market for sponsoring this video today. Let's get started in today's video. So last night I asked you guys to send me some selfies and I mentioned that I was going to be face tuning slash editing your selfies. So today I've picked four four I think I have four or five I do have to say though like all the photos that I got they're all so perfect like none of them needed editing or need editing and um, I was actually looking for one that I could like you know really improve or really make like look really dramatically different but you guys all your skin like no one has one pimple on their face like it was just like wow so these photos are already like perfect seriously but I'm just gonna be enhancing them with my um, editing knowledge I don't have much editing knowledge but I wanted to make this video because it seems really fun to do and I just kind of want to like mess around with like editing and stuff so yeah let's get started okay so I'm gonna start with this photo I'm starting by defocusing the background. It's normally what I do. Don't really get like her hair there though, so. And then I put it down like a lot so it's not really too much. So like her skin really doesn't need like smoothing out, but for the pur purpose of the video I'm going to. And then, yeah, I'll put it at like 80 or something. Okay, I'm gonna add some like color on her eyelid, like it looks like she's wearing, to make it look like, I don't know, she's wearing some peachy tones or something. I don't know how this is gonna turn out because I've never really done this before, but it's kind of cute. Okay, and then I'm gonna do like add more eyeliner. I don't know if she's wearing eyeliner, but I'm gonna add some like definition to the eye. Let's try the paint. Wow. Oops. Not mean to do that. It's cute. A little bit too much there. Okay. And then there's like a glitter feature. I'm gonna try to add some glitter like here, like add more. Cause I see that she has maybe a little highlight there. And then maybe some like and then I'm gonna add some a little bit more color to her lips too but I'm gonna like grab the color from her lips and then I just like tone it on a little bit too much here I'm gonna do that, like, not too much, like, 25. So I'm gonna leave that one like that. Let's go on to the next one. Yeah, I saved this photo in my phone, isn't that hilarious? Okay, she really, like, no one needs any editing, but 
might as well just go for it. I'm going to start by smoothing. Got the highlight going on. Again, I'm just gonna like defocus the background. Doesn't really need too much because like the background isn't like, you know, too crazy or anything. Okay, I'm gonna go to the eyes. Oh. Okay, well, I'm gonna do it myself then. to paint and let's see if I can add like no that's too much mm. that's kind of cute okay, cool. and then I'm going to pick the color Like highlight this area a little bit. I'm gonna go to the dark room. A little bit less contrast. Highlight. Hmm. It's like too bright now. Vibrancy. I like doing this. That's kind of cute. Then I'm gonna soften out this highlight right here because it's a little bit like. filters to have here. That's cute. I like that one. I'm gonna start by cropping this one first. Definitely going to defocus like the whole background a lot. And then like you guys don't need editing, like I don't even know where to start because it's perfect already. <laughs> um smooth first. And then I'll whiten the teeth. Not too much though, because I don't like to be really too much. And then I think like popping her eyes out would be cool. I'm actually gonna go to the paint tones. I'm gonna like pick the color out of here. And then I'm going to add some like contour. I don't know which color. I'm going to try this one first. 
Yeah. Oh, I did not mean to do that. That's kind of cute. I don't really know how to put it on this cheek because it's like, okay, and then add like some blush to the cheeks. Look at this color. Dark room. Definitely some contrast. Maybe a little bit of shadows too. I like sharpening. Just makes everything like more detailed and then vibrancy for sure. Love that. Okay. Kind of like a repetitive process, but I'm starting by smoothing detail the eyes myself, detail the lips a little bit too, and then I'm going to go to Vibrancy and just get her skin, maybe her hair too, actually just the whole thing. See for me I can't put Vibrancy on my hair because I have like blonde hair and it'll look really really like orange in photos so I that's why I'm like used to just doing the skin. I'm gonna take that down to like 37. I'm gonna add blush like I've been always doing but oh wow got a little excited there but too much I'm gonna add like a pinkier lipstick. Oh, sorry. Lips are like hard to do, so I don't know if I'm gonna like this, but. And then I'm just going to put like 20, so it's not too harsh. And then defocus the background, of course. That's what I always do. I'm going to smooth out this area. And then highlight the necklace. I always like detail jewelry and stuff in my pictures. I don't know why I just like doing that. dark room contrast I like contrast a lot no I already have enough of that temperature no cute and then I think I have one more yes Make sure it's still okay. Obviously, you guys know me by now. I start by smoothing or like defocusing the background, but I'm gonna start by smoothing. And then I'm detailing the eyes, they pop out more. Ow, my butt hurts from sitting on the floor. Okay, and then just add some vibrancy to her skin. Down like halfway. Sometimes this thing is slow. Then I'm gonna defocus the background. She has like a poster of a guy back there or something. 
Who is it? Okay, I'm gonna add a little bit more color to the cheeks. Start by like, well, it's pretty harsh, but. And then I'll do some blush. So it's pretty much like putting makeup on people too. <laughs> like editing makeup on people. I don't know. Just because like there's you guys don't need editing, so it's like I don't know what else to do to make this video like exciting. Oh my god. Uh oh, what did I do? Okay, and then definitely go down a little bit. Okay, and then I'm gonna go to the dark room. I'm gonna do like some contrast here and then some light green a little bit lighter. And then vibrancy, definitely a little bit more vibrancy. Sharpen, tad. Cute. What else? Oh, I'm gonna go to the eyes and then make them clear. That's pretty much it. Alright guys, that was actually a lot of fun. Um, like I said, like there's not that much difference in the photos because you guys are perfect already. You don't need editing. But um thank you guys for watching this video. I hope you I I hope you enjoyed this video. Let me know what you guys want to see next and if you guys want to see a video like this um, again. Make sure to like this video and subscribe to my channel to see more videos. Follow me on Instagram at SabrinaVaz123 and we'll talk soon. Love you. Bye. Ow.